Hey guys, it's Mike here, and this is the first episode of Star Labs Made Easy. Today we're going to be looking at Superman. So this first mission is called Getting Started. It's against the Flash, and it's definitely, definitely the easiest one. All you need to do is get a five-hit combo and basically do all the things it's telling you to do on screen. You just need to carry on pressing all the buttons on screen. Uh, you don't even actually need to hit your opponent with it. Just press them and it will be fine. And then uh, you end with the finisher and that's mission complete. So the second mission is called the Yellow Sun and it's against Bane and what you need to do is defeat Bane, get a level transition and also have 50 seconds remaining. So what you want to do is just basically batter him into this corner. If you really need health just go into the sunlight and you'll get some. You just want to keep him in this corner, beat him down and then when he's really low health you want to hold back X and initiate the level transition. By this point you should be low enough on health so you should die instantly as you actually put him through the transition. If not should have a few seconds to finish him off outside and that's mission complete This next mission is called Kryptonite Batarangs and it's probably the hardest of all of them. What you've got to do is beat Batman, use one interactive object and then also don't get hit by a Batarang which is obviously the hardest part of it. So what you've got to do is just always be wary of the three attacks he can use to get you. He's got an up Batarang, a normal Batarang and also um, from the meter burn of the slide kick he can throw another Batarang at you. What you want to do is just be careful for those and then just basically get right up in his face and batter him. You also want to use one of those interactive objects like that. And then yeah, just keep using the combo Kryptonite Bash, which is square, square, triangle. Try and keep low and then he just won't be able to get you. And uh, that is mission complete. You're afraid. This ends now. Next one is called Heating Up and it's against the evil Superman. What you've got to do is win the battle, don't miss any button inputs and then also cross the line five times. So what you want to do is do two separate runs. First time, don't miss any button inputs and then the second time, you just want to cross the line five times. So to do that, you've just got to keep pushing it over the line and then as it comes back, make sure it doesn't hit you. Push it back, but obviously make sure it doesn't hit him. Do it five times and then uh, obviously that is mission complete. So the next one is called Reign of Fire and it's against Cyborg. What you've got to do is defeat Cyborg win without being hit by more than five pieces of debris so win without being hit by six pieces of debris and you have to connect ten special moves you don't have to connect ten in a row it's just ten in the course of the battle so the strategy for this is just don't jump at all and just try and batter him in the corners but always be watching with your peripheral vision for where the things are coming down and you just want to use back back or forward forward so that you can escape them and obviously you can actually lure him into them and it will uh, hurt him a little bit. What you're going to want to do as well is probably do one of the uh, super moves because you're just going to take a huge amount of health off. Though I did it a really blunderous time there. 
Anyway, so if you do all of that stuff, that'll be mission complete. Mission 6 is called Meteor from Krypton and it's against Catwoman. What you want to do is go to training and learn this combo I'm showing you here. What it is is juggle, then uppercut, and then square, square, square. The only hard thing about it is actually timing the square, 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 but if you practice it a few times you'll get it. And you want to go to the mission, do the combo, then survive. And you want to do a separate mission where you get the two grabs. I think it makes it a lot easier that way. And when you are trying to survive, you basically just want to get to the back and get down and do low punch or punch the groin as I like to call it and then you'll have three stars mission complete so the next one is called save the human and what you've got to do is save the citizen don't miss an incoming threat and also kill the bugs so what you want to do is basically just get these two moves down and then once you've done that just look down on the screen for when the bugs are going to appear and because in your peripheral vision you can see everything else coming and you can just get them pretty easily so wait it is pretty hard to see it took me a while actually to see but there you go there the bugs you smash them then you carry on with the mission so the only other hard thing to do is killing the big robot thing at the end and to do that you just want to spam the down back x combo um, but what i did realize with that as well if you do it too quick you will end up messing up so slow and steady wins the race with that one and if you do it all you will have got three stars This next one is called Noxious Fumes and it's against the Joker. It's pretty easy to be honest. All you've got to do is defeat the Joker without using any special powers and also finish him with a throw. So what you want to do is just punch him basically. Just spam the Kryptonian Bash combo which is square square triangle. Um, you can throw stuff, you can do other stuff as well but you just don't use any special attacks. Then what you want to do is move him over to the right here. And eventually you're going to interact and use a transition which will beat him down a lot. And then it makes it pretty easy to kill him in the next room with a final throw. So once you've done all that stuff, it'll be mission complete. So the next mission is called Man of Steel. It's against Grundy, Black Adam, and it's against Doomsday as well. What you've got to do is defeat them all. Then you've got to win only using punches and then you've got to connect 10 special moves like the cyborg one. So what you want to do is do two separate ones. The first one, only use punches. Um, so you can use that square square triangle one again or triangle triangle X, whatever you want to use for that. Defeat them all and then that will be that start. And then the next time you just want to connect with 10 special moves against one opponent. So pretty sure the actual super move counts as one because I can only count nine in this video. Uh, check it out for yourself and let me know. And yeah, if you do all that stuff, that'll be mission complete with three stars. So the final Superman mission is called Kryptonite Plated. And what you've got to do is defeat Lex, win without jumping, and win with a super move. So like in a lot of the other ones, I'd suggest doing two runs. First time, you can jump around, do whatever you want, and then just finish with a super move. And the second one, you just want to win without jumping. So all you got to do, I think, is just use the D-pad. Make sure you're only pressing left and right. Keep doing the combos to beat him down. At this beginning bit, uh, you just want to do quick fist combos to try and finish him as quick as possible. And then, like I said, you just want to beat him down. Try and get him into a corner because he's pretty beast from range. And eventually, as you wear him down and beat him without jumping, you have completed it with three stars. you can 
ends now. Well, I hope this video helped you out and the next episode I'll be doing will be Batman. So please like and subscribe and I'll see you then.